Na, sziasztok, újra itt vagyok, én Walter vagyok. És szerintem folytassuk is a visszajövőben játéknak a következő részével. Beállítom az időzítőt újabb 30 percre. És szerintem ne teket óriázzunk, hanem szedjük ki Ednából, amit tudni akarunk, hogy igazából hol van az öreg Doki. Én tuti biztos tarkon vágnám az öreg asszony. Ez egy jó kérdés. Hi, what a nosy Nelly! No one likes a busybody, you know. But oh, fine. Let me think about it. Uh, yes, I, I remember. I, I lost it in a scuffle with a, a dog. Oh, when was it? Oh, yes, the day that Speakeasy burned down. <laughs> a speakeasy in Hill Valley? Don't act so surprised, young man. Your generation doesn't hold a copyright on moral depravity, you know. <laughs> Sin has been on the prowl in Hill Valley since the day it was founded. Wow, a speakeasy. That must have been wild. Is it true they used to drink gin out of slippers like my grandma said? Don't romanticize the past, young man. Prohibition was a time when gangsters ruled the town while honest citizens <laughs> waked in their beds. Hol volt az Where That speakeasy that burned down, I mean. That was ages ago. If you're looking for bootleg hooch... Nem érdekel a no, Champions Piaz időpont honlá. I'm a, a student of history. Student of history, my Aunt Fanny! Yeah, your generation of hooligans and slackers could give two ripe things about history. Strickland? Oh, video store! Huh? The speakeasy used to be hidden in plain sight down there in the town square. Right where that disgusting ah. videotape rental store squats today. The video store building must have gone up after the speakeasy burned down. The following year, as I recall. What's with all these newspapers? This is my personal archive. I've got every issue of the Hill Valley Telegraph ever published. Get out. Every single issue. From 1871 to the present. <laughs> If it happened in Hill Valley, you'll find it in my stacks. That's a bad thing. I guess somewhere in these stacks there must be an article about the speakeasy burning down. Naturally. Yeah, I probably wrote it myself. I was quite a reporter back in the day. Any idea what date that article came out? Well, obviously the day after the speakeasy burned down. Doing some stargazing? No, I set my sights on the lower things. Is that? Jim Tannen! Get away from that hubcap before I call your father! Ő a tiért figyelő kamera. Na, szerintem innen meg tudtunk. Ööö... Ez frankó jobb, mint a térfigyelő kamerák, és még ingyen is van. Don't touch those! My newspapers are in pristine condition and meticulously organized. Not about to let some street punk get jam all over them. Mert szerintem, hogy az előbb nem tudtuk azt, hogy mit keresünk. Amúgy rohadt lassan ford fel a víz. És én megint átvettem. Istenem, ez az öreg asszony. Round mansion destroyed. 
1962. No, no, that's not where Doc's stranded. Nem a Brown Curia. All right, Einstein brought me this shoe, and Miss Strickland lost the shoe on the day the speakeasy burned down. But when did the speakeasy burn down? I at least need to know the year. Firm announces plans for Lone Pine Mall, Peabody Ranch to be rezoned for commercial I'll development. Show you. I don't even know where to start looking for clues in these stacks. Wish I could narrow it down to a year at least. Clint Eastwood plunges to death on runaway train. I don't even know where to start looking for clues in these stacks. Wish I could narrow it down to a year at least. October 28th, 1982. Authorities still mystified by Mall's shootout. I don't even know where to start looking for clues in the at least. May I tell? October twenty eighth. You as I would say, don't even know where to start looking for clues. October twenty eighth. Okay. I don't even know where to start looking for at least. May I tell? Should we let the two of us handle it? Hey, uh, mind if I use your binoculars for a sec? Go ahead, dear. Oh yeah, Peter Hollins got the February ever. That's it. Built in February 1932. So the fire must have happened before then. But when? I need a date. Don't look at me. I'm far too old for you. Na és akkor most már tudunk egy behatárolható időpontot, akkor megint a radiátor. There's the whistle. Surely the water's boiling by now. Persze, persze, menjél csak. Csak csak be is kellene gyújtani a táskannal a te véhülye. Na. Let's see. Ground broken on site of former speakeasy. Singer vanishes. Hill Valley Expo delights crowd. Soup kitchen exposed. Here we go. Speakeasy arsonist slain. Legal procedure gave way to old-fashioned vengeance last night when a mob descended on the Hill Valley Police Station. The suspect in the speakeasy arson case, a drifter known as Carl Sagan, was pulled from his. Carl Sagan. It's Doc. Killed by a mob. What's the date? June fourteenth, nineteen thirty-one. Geez, I gotta rescue him. My newspapers. Sorry, Miss Strickland. Let me. No, you've gotten my history out of order. Oh, do you know how long it'll take to fix what you've done? Oh, get out! Get out! Get out! Help! Police! I'm being attacked by hooligans. Who is it that's so scary? Marty, where you been, son? And what are you doing in that getup? I got the lead in the school play. We're doing Grapes of Wrath. Right. Oh, Steinbeck. Who are you playing? Um, uh... never mind. You don't have to explain. I'm sure whatever it is you're up to, you know what you're doing, right? I hope so. Hey, sometimes you gotta go out on a limb for the ones you love, right? Wish my dad had understood that. You won't stay away too long. You'll barely know I was gone. Just go to bed. Shoot it, Shambesi. Ready to go, Einstein? No. I've got to turn on the time circuits first. You wish us home, don't you? Time circuits. Ah, flux capacitor. Uh, fluxy. Okay. If Doc's gonna get killed on June fourteenth, nineteen thirty-one, I'll just show up the day before and get him out. I hope you know what you're doing, Doc.
Hát én mondjuk visszamentem volna egy héttel hamarabb legalább. És lehet, hogy más sittem van. Úgy egyébként is teljesen megakadályoztam volna. Ez rohadt jó. A legjobb rejtek hely. <gül> Na? Eléggé moziszerű a játék egyébként, tehát olyan nagyon-nagyon sok mindent nem kell csinálni. Einstein, where do you go now, boy? Ez meg az öreg asszony, nem? Young man, excuse me, young man. Who? Uh, me? You're the only man in the street, and I'm looking for a man in the street reaction. Naturally, you know about the explosion that destroyed this illegal gin establishment. I read about it, yeah. What's your opinion of Carl Sagan, the stranger who single-handedly did what the law has been unable to do for ten long years, namely rid Hill Valley of the scourge of liquor? Uh. You can mark me down as a supporter, the young man said, flashing a boyish yet virile grin. Hill Valley needs more upstanding youths like yourself. Do you have a message for the vicious gangsters who still roam these streets, no doubt plotting to corrupt our citizens with another den of booze, sin, and debauchery? Ask them where I can get the address. Ah, I see. Because you want to blast it to smithereens, just like Carl Sagan did. With public-spirited citizens like you around, the lawless element will be on the run in no time. Mr... may I get your name? Yeah, it's... <laughs> Michael Corleone. Legyünk az. Még a Sonic Rocketchers. Legyünk Mike. Michael Corleone. Michael Corleone. Thank you for sharing your candid opinions, Mr. Corleone. Edna Strickland, Hill Valley Herald. I know. I met you back. I mean, I'm familiar with your work. You read my column? How sweet! I know it's just an etiquette column, but I believe it'll lead to bigger and better... Oh! Einstein, no! Down, boy! Is this wretched creature yours? He assaulted me once before! What's got into you? Aggressive dogs must be kept on leash at all times. It's the law. Look it up! Doc, I gotta find Doc.
A doki szerintem shit-tel van. Nézzünk be a borbe üzletbe. A nő egyébként itt se volt éppen a legkedvesebb. És itt mindenki a rohadt kedves. Nézzünk be ebbe a garniszállóba. Shark. Jó, itt ez ennyi. Papír oldal is benézhetünk. Nem. No. Fú, de kedvesek. És aztán egy csavargó. Na, nézzük. Ez hatalmas az a zukkos megyéken. Na, itt van az ügyvéd iroda. Hát, ha itt meg tudjuk, hogy hol van a doki. Anyám, de kedvesek. Bank. How can I help you, sir? Without any money, I don't really have any business in there. Where is the jail in 1931 anyway? Szerintem itt lesz majd valahol. Ez mi? Névkonyha. Úristen. Hoppá, itt be lehetett jönni. Ez milyen ilyen hajléktalan kiszolgáló? McFly! Biff? Kid! Grandpa? That's Mr. Tannen to you, Artie. What are you doing out here? Well, I was getting kind of hungry, so I figured I'd come down here for some free soup. Just thought I'd come down for some soup. Think, McFly. The DA's throwing around subpoenas like Babe Ruth. I don't think Ruth's a pitcher anymore. Shut it. If one of those subpoenas landed in the hands of my number cruncher, I'd be in a whole lot of trouble. I could even get sent up the river. You wouldn't want that, would you? Would you? Uh, no. Of course not, kid. All right. That's better. What are you looking at, punk? Anyádat. Keep your eyes on the soup, kid. Well? Well, what? What are you still doing here? Sorry, kid. I'll just run back to the safe house. You do that. And McFly? Yes? That hat's too flashy. You better let me hold on to it. Ah. Uh, now scram! You got it, boss. And don't come out until I give you the all clear. I swear, if even one of you mooks could add two plus two without your fingers, I'd dump that wimp into the lake. Hey! Anyway, I'm off to make myself irresistible. Don't let anyone burn down the shop while I'm gone. Ahem. <clears throat> okay. Hát ez is ilyen rohadt kedves. Van telefon. Fickó. Nézzük a feladatokat. Lazy hands make a man poor, but diligent hands bring wealth. Maybe that's my problem. Lazy hands. Maybe I should go to the jail and talk to Doc before I start dialing random people in 1931. Okay. 
fuel-ból, az nem nagyon szeretne velünk beszélni. Hopp, ott pult ajtó. Aha. Q volt, valahogy ki kéne csalogatni onnan. Ezek szerint. Nice rack. Yeah, we got all kinds of the uh, culinary enhancements back there. Uh-huh. Is that what we have to get from you? Is it good? Yeah, I think I got a snack of it. I thought we were going to get a snack of it. I just got a pet of it. Majd lesz, szóval kimegyünk, ide még szemben vissza kell térnünk, csak előbb beszélni kell a dokival. Mert valószínűleg mondom, hogy fog olyan információt, ami miatt telefonálnunk kell. Na. I can sightsee later. Right now I've got to find the dock. Senki nem nézelődik. Ez itt a rendőrös. Itt lesz bent a doki. Who are you and what do you want? Can I talk to uh, Carl Sagan? Are you his lawyer? Um, no. Then scram. Miért nem mondtad azt, hogy igen? A börtön ablak. A börtön ablakában. Itt a doki. Doc! What are you doing here? You sent for me, Doc. I did? When? May 14th, 1986. 1980? <gasps> the automatic retrieval system. Of course. I'd almost forgotten about that. So what's our plan for getting you out of here? Plan? We don't need a plan. We don't. Not in the slightest. The police picked me up for that speakeasy fire a couple of weeks ago. But the DA hasn't got a case. They're releasing me tomorrow morning. So basically, I traveled 50 years into the past to deliver your car? Sorry about that, but it's so wonderful to see you. We have a lot of catching up to do. Yeah, you, you might want to hold off on that, Doc. Great Scott! I'm going to be gunned down by gangsters on the steps of the courthouse! Why would they do that? Guess they didn't approve of my burning down their speakeasy. Very funny, Doc. Maybe now we should come up with a plan? A plan? Right. But what? Elmenjünk, menjünk vissza az időbe. Why don't I take the DeLorean, go back in time before you were arrested, and stop you from getting caught in the first place? Don't even think about it. Without my unjust incarceration, the events that sent you into the past might never happen, resulting in a paradox of continuum shattering proportions. Igazi idő paradoxon. Jeez, we were back together for five minutes, Doc, and you're already talking about the end of the universe. I've missed that. Don't be ridiculous, Marty. I was only referring to the end of the universe as we know it. De hogyha most uh, Márti megakadályozza azt, hogy a dokit lelőjék a bíróság uh, épületének a lépcsőjén, akkor az nem fog belekerülni az újságokba. Ergo a jövőben Márti nem fogja megtalálni az öregasszonynak a lakása, az az újságot, ahol a dokit le van fényképezve, hogy agyan lőjük. És nem lesz semmi, ami sarkolja arra, hogy visszajöjjön a dokiért, megbenteni az életét, ugye? És ha nem jön vissza, akkor viszont megint lelőjük a dokit. Fú, baszki. Well, I suppose I could just get some dynamite and break you out of jail. No, no, that's far too dangerous. Not just to me, but to random innocent people in the past. The repercussions could be... <gasps> that's it! What's it? My rocket-powered drill. Rocket-powered <laughs> drill? Not yet. I haven't built it yet. You've lost me, Doc. Listen. A few months ago, my 17-year-old self sent in a patent application for a rocket-powered drill. I abandoned the project after I never heard back from the patent office, but the prototype should be nearly complete. Great, I'll just run back to your lab and... No, no, I said nearly complete. You need me to help you finish it. How the hell am I supposed to sneak a half-finished rocket-powered drill into your cell? Not me, me! 1931 me! Wait a minute, Doc. 
You want me to convince your 1931 self to build a rocket-powered drill to break you out of jail? Precisely. Is that here to continue? Won't talking to yourself cause you know irreparable damage to the space-time continuum or something? It should be fine. I've already invented the idea of the rocket drill. You've just got to go, my younger self, into finishing the prototype. You wish I'd been there. I'm supposed to convince your younger self to finish the rocket drill. Just tell him I need to break his older self out of jail. Absolutely <laughs> yeah. not. Whatever you do, you can't tell my younger self anything about time travel. I won't come up with the inspiration for the flux capacitor for another 24 years. Then what am I supposed to? Just be your charming self. From what I remember, I'm a pretty easygoing kid, so enlisting me in a scientific adventure should be a piece of cake. You wish for him. Okay, let's say I go along with this crazy idea. Where can I find you? I mean, uh, the other you. How should I know? It was over 50 years ago. Why did you go over to the soup kitchen next door and give my house a call? They'll know where to find me. Uh -huh. Soup kitchen. I should say that it's someone who went It'll cause irreparable damage to your digestive system. I guess I better get started. Don't worry, Doc. I'll get you out of here in no time. New guy, Doc. Mean that I'm with us. Once you and my younger self put your heads together, you'll be unstoppable. I don't feel like anything. Hello, Bill. Show me. As soon as I get there, I'll just get the whole thing sorted. Hey, this is all too much. I'm just gonna. Uh. Na gyerünk be a nyírkonyába, és akkor telefonáljunk szerintem egyet. Do you know where I could find Emmett Brown? Young Master Brown is currently tending to his clerking duties at the courthouse. Who may I say is calling? Master Cool. Courthouse? Doc never told me he worked at the courthouse. Uh, at the court, when you go to the shaggy, you put it in. He's in Piaus, let's go. Piaus shaggy, you didn't tell me about Piaus shaggy. Menjünk a bíróság épületéhez. Vagy hát magába be a bíróság. Az lenne az út. Sászos. Hát itt van Einstein. Ah, shiftet kell nyom, nem a jobb klikket. Na. És itt van az eleg. Amit a doki. Ezek nagyon szentetív legal dokumentek. Nobody is supposed to handle them, but sworn officers of the court. Papa, I mean, Judge Brown says so. Judge Brown? Doc. Uh, nice to meet you. I'm Michael, uh, Corleone. Emmett Brown. But I am a law clerk, not a doctor. Now please get out of my way. I have important business to transact. Mm-hmm. Naturally, H2A multiplied by the inversion of H has to come out less than expectation value. Or do we take H as half of the middle line up? But in that case, H to the A multiplied by the inverse. Listen, Emmett, you don't know me, but I'm your friend. I'm not big on friends. They get in the way of work. Come on, Doc. Uh, Emmett, uh, drop the legal eagle act. I got something more important for you to do. 
Mr. Corleone, I'll have you know that the law is the very mortar that holds society together. And we in the legal profession are like brick masons building the edifice of the future. Your dad tell you that? Every morning. Na, időnk közben lejárt, de ezt még itt uh, végigjátszom ezt a monológot. Na, ne aggódj, én is tudós vagyok. Nézzük meg. I'm sort of in the science business myself. That's why I sought you out. Not that I care in the least, because science is the furthest thing from my own area of interest, which is law, but I don't believe you. It's true. I'm a scientist. So tell me something, Mr. Scientist, from your vast storehouse of scientific knowledge. Uh, the leg bone's connected to the thigh bone? Amazing. <laughs> Listen. I understand you're working on a new invention in your lab. Invention? You must have me mixed up with somebody else. I'm in law. I have absolutely no interest uh -huh. in science. How many newtons are required to maintain a constant mass of acceleration? Oh, wait up a minute. You again? Can't you see I'm busy? Okay. You don't want your old man to know. That's fine. Listen, we all keep secrets. But I'm telling you, you can level with me about this science project of yours. The... I am not a scientist. Go ahead, ask me what E equals. What does E equal? I have absolutely no idea. See? I don't know where you got your information from about me, mister, but you're wrong, wrong, wrong! Ay, ay, ay. Emet, emet. I better not. Those lawyers sound kind of nasty. Will you just give me a chance? Harassment's a federal crime, Mr. Corleone. Come on, you could trust me, Doc. Uh, Emmett, it's your future I'm looking out for. In more ways than one. What are you talking about? I'm talking about you and science. Oh, that word again! If you insinuate I'm a scientist once more, I'll sue you for defamation of character! Harassment's a federal crime, Mr. Corleone! And about your... say it! Now if H stands for... Will you just give me a chance? Harassment's a federal crime, Mr. Corleone! What's this important business you're up to? It's a legal matter, very complicated, very abstruse. I need to obtain five sets of initials on every copy of this writ of indemnification before Pop, I mean, before Judge Brown can even think of granting a waiver to the party in the first part. You have no idea what it's about, do you? That's how important it is. So Emmett, what time are you through with work? Depends. On weeknights, Pop sometimes keeps me in the office till nine. Nine and night, but today's Saturday. Entry. Right, so I probably won't get off before ten. How about you knock off work early and I'll buy you a beer, uh, or soda. Now, what do you say? Don't try to tempt me from my duty with sugary beverages. Keeping the wheels of justice turning, that's my one passion in life. Besides, <laughs> if I left before eight, right? my pop would kill me. Sounds like you're a little scared of your father. Scared of my father? Pop is the most learned, just, incorruptible judge that Hill Valley has ever seen. The only people scared of Judge Brown are people with a dark secret to hide. And I don't have a dark secret to hide. Sounds like you're a little scared. Scared of my father has ever seen. Secret to hide. And, uh, about your... say it. Just give me a chance. Harassment's a... Hát nincs más opció. Na jó srácok, az időnk is letelt. Egyelőre nem sikerült az ifjú Emmett Brown-t rábeszélni, hogy segítsen Mártinak. Az az nekünk. De mindent meg fogunk tenni. Sounds like you're a little scared of your father. 
Nem, nem tudom, hogy hogy. És hadd menjen csak emelt, jó? Na, akkor mi várda a következő harmadik részben. Addig lejöttek jók, ha tetszett a videó, akkor nyomjatok egy lájkot, illetve iratkozzatok fel. Köszönöm szépen a figyelmeteket, sziasztok!